Thanks a lot uh, of, uh, for interaction, uh, Erwin, and it's a nice occasion for me to be here and uh, to inform about uh, our activities in the frame of uh, the project uh, Symbio. Uh, today I, I would like to show you uh, one uh, wild uh, example how to uh, transfer uh, the uh, scientific uh, knowledge into the praxis. Uh, this is a picture from the city of the Brno, uh, the second largest city in the Czech Republic, and uh, there is a grasslands uh, uh, normally managed uh, each two weeks uh, with cutting, and uh, this is the picture of uh, the uh, uh, vegetation. Uh, it's practic practically a monoculture of the Polygonum aviculare, uh, four, six plants per squ square met meter, uh, very poor uh, stands and very sensitive. Uh, you could see here uh, the status uh, in the time of the dry period of the season. And uh, uh, another story is uh, in the uh, humid part of the season, you could see uh, some uh, weedy species, uh, Malvace and uh, uh, Amaranthus and Henopodium, uh, some, uh, some seedlings uh, from the uh, Lolium and so on. But uh, you could see here that uh, the sensitivity of such grasslands is quite high to the uh, different, uh, uh, different uh, fungal pests. Uh, different example you could find on the rant of the city uh, where uh, the uh, new management started with such an uh, islands and it's, it's very very good example. Uh, we have collaborated with uh, the uh, west part of the city, in uh, the city part of Liskovets. Uh, we have good luck because uh, there is a, a, a natural reservation area with uh, the highest number of the Pulsatila Grandis uh, at all in our uh, uh, our uh, republic in our country and uh, uh, moreover uh, the uh, neighboring uh, retirement uh, house uh, uh, has, uh, has uh, uh, nice understanding for our activities. Uh, there is uh, also a very uh, rare uh, mm, uh, association of the plants with the hemiparasitic uh, plants Melampirum arvense, which uh, uh, um, pressed the tall grasses, and uh, this is a good example for uh, the uh, for the widespreading uh, such commu communities. And uh, the mayor of uh, this, uh, this part of the city started uh, the new attempt uh, to, to the nature because uh, uh, these this, uh, uh, buildings are on the uh, rant of uh, rant, um, on the border between uh, the intensively cultivated uh, agriculture. Uh, landscape and uh, the uh, the city. So uh, this uh, artificial uh, um, uh, artificial uh, sea uh, is uh, fulfilled with with water, with collecting uh, rain uh, rainwater uh, from this uh, roof, and uh, this is the uh, main architect uh, of. Uh, 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 this uh, uh, this um, management uh, uh, engineer, diploma engineer, uh, Fergot, and uh, in the frame of our project, uh, project of the cross-border uh, activities, uh, we visited with our uh, Austrian partner uh, this locality, and this is a, an example uh, of uh, the. Um, Biodi biodiversity there. So, back to the soil. Uh, 
we should think uh, deeply about uh, the uh, balanced life. It's an example from the uh, uh, forest soil, and we could see the, uh, the relationship between uh, the uh, roots, uh, microorganisms, and uh, uh, fungal filaments, and uh, how uh, the soil structure looks like. So we could compare it with uh, the green sky skyscraper and compare it uh, with uh, the normal building and uh, think about the structure of the uh, uh, soil and structure of the compacted arable soil no nowadays. So it's very nice for microorganisms and uh, filamentous uh, microorganisms to live here and to have an attempt of, uh, uh, for, for the uh, air and, and water and uh, the carbohydrates. Uh, similar situation we could see here on the, this Petri dishes. Uh, if we inoculate with the number of the microorganisms from the same species, they are competing immediately uh, with uh, themselves. And uh, uh, in the contrary, if uh, you apply only one, uh, one uh, uh, cell uh, on the fresh medium, you could, uh, uh, you could obtain more biomass and more activity of uh, the uh, uh, microorganisms. How it is possible? Uh, the, the solution is uh, very simply, the microorganisms permanently inform each other about uh, the situation, about the number with the special compounds and uh, they are active only if uh, they, uh, their number are sufficient and uh, uh, because of it, uh, they, uh, they are, uh, they, they uh, uh, exhaust uh, the, the carbohydrates very quickly and they are competing uh, themselves. For the uh, building uh, of the soil is uh, extraordinarily important uh, the balance between the different species. And if you imagine that uh, in one gram uh, in the soil is uh, many thousand of the uh, uh, independent uh, species which are controlling permanently themselves uh, and uh, there are uh, another uh, soil inhabitants, uh, they are responsible for the soil architecture. Uh, and uh, which are fulfilled with uh, the balance uh, microbial communities. Uh, no wonder that uh, the uh, soil microaggregates are so stable and uh, they could persist uh, uh, tens of years uh, in the soil. And uh, if you focus uh, the, the, uh, uh, your attention on uh, this part, with the resting soil water, which could represent the source for the for the uh, for the plants uh, in the period of the draw, and uh, you look inside uh, in uh, this uh, microbial buildings and uh, the microbial biofilms, and uh, you could imagine the activity of the microorganisms uh, uh, dropped in uh, uh, this structure. 500 to 5,000 times, and they are only uh, uh, remaining alive. Uh, there is uh, the, the information, please don't dis uh, disturb, we are starving uh, now. And uh, the business are immediately starting uh, in, the, uh, um, uh, in the time of uh, the uh, um, uh, of uh, the invasion of the plant roots and uh, for the first view uh, it looks like uh, uh, very chaotic but uh, believe me uh, microorganisms are able to understand such a milieu they are permanently producing information compounds and they, they are informing uh, themselves if the situation is uh, uh, appropriate for the changing the activity from the individual one to the group behavior. 
So the, the market in the soil is starting uh, with uh, the producing the, the first uh, liquid compounds and uh, with, the, uh, with the stimulation of the microbes. And uh, moreover, the, the uh, information is uh, now uh, uh, available about the managing role of the some uh, microbial species which, has, which are controlling the activity if the uh, biodiversity of microorganisms is uh, uh, enough. So we are, uh, uh, we, are, uh, um, we are trying to apply such information practically because uh, uh, normally if you uh, change uh, the, the uh, composition of uh, uh, your meadow, uh, the first task is to scrape uh, to remove the topsoil and transporting uh, to the for the compost for instance and uh, the the replace uh, this topsoils with the sterile substrate with a high amount of uh, the the clay or or a sand and uh, together with with uh, the um, um, uh, seed mixture you want so uh, we, we have found the, the possibility in the retirement uh, house and first of all we changed the management of the uh, grassland and uh, we start because I am very lazy. I would like to try some, uh, some um, pilot uh, experiment. This is one, the, this is uh, uh, professional uh, workers, uh, professional uh, uh, gardenings. Uh, uh, they are uh, uh, not able to understand such an attempt. We simply uh, uh, remove the topsoil and uh, uh, turn up the topsoil, and uh, as possible, as much as possible, uh, we uh, uh, try to. Uh, to uh, respect the integrity of such a, a pollster. So we simply add the seed, watering and waiting. And after two months, yeah, this is starting this, and uh, this uh, uh, photo was made uh, two years, uh, two, two days uh, ago, and we are waiting for the seedlings which are germinating uh, for the target uh, mixture uh, below this, uh, this uh, uh, um, flowers which are uh, attractive for the inhabitants. So thank you for the, uh, for the attention and uh, excuse me, I'm uh, too long.